Hello, what's going on? I'm back again. So, uh, the company I'm going to talk about today is called Urban Star Organics. It's a uh, it's a brand that we've been carrying in our shop for the, since they since they started their business, which is a little over a year ago, if I'm I think I'm right. Uh, so it's been interesting to see over the years how kind of the jewelry market has changed. You know, uh, back in the day, pieces like Urban Star would have been over hundred like over a hundred dollars for sure. But it's been really cool to see a new company come that has really pushed the envelope of making really unique, you know, um, really fun and just different pieces that are not insanely overpriced. So it's been really cool to see that. So I'm going to, I've got kind of most of my desk here filled up with uh, quite a few pieces I thought that were at least show worthy of theirs. So uh, I'll start with just showing some of their basics. Uh, so here's some of their basics. Uh, you have like stars, these are made of horn, lotus flowers, uh, and then like the basic horn coils, and uh, let's see, and the cool thing about a lot of their pieces is that um, they have a lot of cool like floral styles and animal styles, so the floral ones have been really unique, and to me I've never seen anything like it, when they first started coming in I was like wow, they are really insane pieces. So we'll start with like the floral pieces here. Um, these are their wildflower in a ring wood. Look at the detail on that, isn't that beautiful? And orchids. These are really cool when I got these in. I actually grew up working in a flower shop, at my mom's flower shop in Louisville, Kentucky. And uh, we sold many orchids. The detail on this is insane. It literally looks like a legitimate orchid. So I was really shocked to get these in. This one's called Queen Daisy. Look at all the petals on that, really detailed. And let's see. This style was one of their first floral styles. And when we first got these in, it was a straight up stunner. I'll have to say, this was a, a, a style that I had never seen and I didn't think could even be made. And so these are their orang rosebuds. So um, obviously this is a bigger one. They, they range from eight gauge to two inch. This is a two gauge, this is inch and three quarters. So even on the little ones, the detail is just insane. Like very detailed, just epic craftsmanship. And the bigger pieces, you know, really high detail. And the bigger ones are generally a little heavier just because they're a huge piece of wood. But uh, really nice pieces. And the price on these is so fair, it's, it's unbelievable. Really good deal. And here's another floral piece. Is these bone, these bone flowers. I don't know how well you can see those in there. But uh, let's see, and here's one more I wanted to show you, is the white flowers. Wow, how pretty is that? And let's see, so that's kind of most of their floral stuff. So we'll move on to their kind of animal pieces. Uh, they have quite a few like owls and, you know, different kind of things that are people's favorite kind of animals, I guess. So here's a cool set. These are the hooty owls. Nice. And we've got, oh snap, and we've got the, uh, I believe this one's called Mr. Owl. It's like kind of a standard owl style. And then, I always like this one. This is my favorite of the owls, is these big old bug-eyed owls. Love that. And, let's see, what did I miss here? Turtles. How cool is that? Look at the detail on that. You can even see the little turtle's eyes and everything. And butterflies. This is a new style we just got in not too long ago. And uh, these are really cool because the actual, if you can actually see that, how big it actually comes up off the plug. So it really makes it look super big on your ear, you know. And uh, let's see. Elephants. I love these when we got these in. I'll have to say I'm a big cat fan myself. Love me some kitties. Kitty cat. And uh, jackalope. I still don't even know what the hell a jackalope is, but these are pretty cool. And you can actually see the uh, the little uh, horns. It's, it's a bone piece inlaid for the horn. So uh, pretty interesting and very funny. Everyone always has something to say about these plugs. 
and these to me are their best ones and I would say in our current inventory these would be a top 10 to me uh, these are their frogs look at the detail on these tell me that isn't insane even on the back it's crazy how detailed even like the back of his legs and all that is just insane on that lily pad so like I said I would say for sure these are top 10 that I've personally seen in any plugs really nice pieces and okay that's most of the main let's see animals we do have a few more animals we'll move on to the uh, hooks here this is a new style we just got in peahen hooks I don't know how good you can see that and uh, lockets these are really nice bonsai trees and this one's kind of a basic style but really pretty still made of bone these are the cascade hooks and check this spiral good googly moogly three quarters of an inch that's beautiful and so they also carry a few other kind of like random obscure styles these these aren't meant for stretched ears they're kind of a uh, they're called stirrups so you can wear these and I believe 16 gauge so uh, but you know all hand carved wood really beautiful pieces even for non stretched ears and of course the septum mustache and last but not least slanging wieners up in here what do you know oh lordy and uh... let's see that is just that's about all of them right there so yeah i thought those were some of their some of their cooler styles that i thought were worth mentioning so, like I said, it's been really cool to see a, you know, a new company come along that is putting out some really good pieces at a fair price. So, I would highly recommend if you're interested in checking out some, you know, really obscure custom type pieces, definitely check out some Urban Star stuff because it's really top quality and epic price. So, uh, anyways, we carry a full selection of Urban Star stuff on our website and uh, I guess I'll check you all out in the next vid. See you later. Peace.